What would you give up? Sex or food? <laughs> So I've been trying to vlog and Bailey is just so angry. I have a new trick. I have popcorn, homemade popcorn, so that every time she gets angry, I'm just gonna give her some popcorn. But she's so noisy. Can you hear that? Louder! <laughs> Kiss mommy. I have high five. Oh, I popcorn. <laughs> this is homemade popcorn. So this is very healthy. So it's okay for her to eat it. Okay, so anyway, on to our vlog for today. No, because I've never done this in my channel before, like get to know me kind of vlog. So this is it. This is like get to know me vlog. I search random questions on Google and uh, about like how to get to know a person. So I wrote them here in colorful paper. I'm just gonna answer them to this camera to you. <laughs> just gonna get to know me kind of vlog. Okay, let me shake. Okay. Let's do a green one. Really? Can you read this? <laughs> okay. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Who was your favorite teacher and why? My favorite college professor was uh, Mr. Roland Chua. Mr. Roland Chua made me uh, like Philippine history and all about like Philippine what did he teach? So he taught us Rizal, Philippine history, Philippine constitution. So um, I like those subjects because of him because he made those subjects interesting. So before I didn't really like history. Okay. Hobbies! So actually I have a lot of hobbies that I don't follow up so I don't continue them. I like to try new hobbies like for example journaling. I like journaling. I tried out journaling. I do have lots of um, things for journaling, um, <laughs> drawing, I like to draw on Procreate Ooh. on my iPad Pro, I like playing with my dog, <laughs> let's do a green one, okay, product you can't live without, so there's a couple of products that I can't live without now that I'm living here in China, so one of them is the space sculpting device. So you just put it around your head at night and it will help create this V-shaped kind of um, jaw. <laughs> um, and one more is the RNW nose strip. I found that their nose strip is much better. It doesn't irritate my skin and they have like two steps. One is to um, open up your pores and then another one is to close your pores. I like their product. And also, uh, say, I don't know if I'm pronouncing this correctly, Okay, so wrap sunscreen and sunblock. I like that a lot because they have like this kind of, um, it's a like a foundation tint. So it's like two in one. I like that. I stopped using foundation months ago and I started using Serab. I found out that it's much healthier for my skin because I'm not going out. But I do use foundation, especially now I'm using foundation. When I do vlogs, I go on interviews. But if it's just like a, you know, day-to-day -day type of thing, like going out with my boyfriend, I don't really need to put on a lot of makeup. Just use face tint or sunblock face tint. Are you okay? <laughs> okay. I don't know, I'm a little scared she can't breathe. Okay. What would you change about yourself? Honestly, if you have asked me this years ago, I would have said like, I wanted to change my body type, I wanted to change this and this and this and this. But now, because I'm already 28, I don't want to change anything about me. I know that what I am right now or who I am right now is because of everything that happened in the past. So I already Ooh. accepted that and I'm okay with that. So no more changing. You are who you are and you should be proud of that. Let's do, okay, <laughs> let's do blue, I guess. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Well, it depends. If I'm really in a hurry, it would take me 15 minutes. But if I have time, it would take me 20 minutes. Let's do a yellow one. What would you give up? Sex or food? <laughs> okay, let's do pink. I like pinks. Do you collect anything? I do. <laughs> I collect a lot of things. I collect journaling stickers. I collect children's books, Ooh. English books, art things actually. I collect art things. I collect like markers, all the art supplies that you need. I have. I have acrylic paint. I have. Um, watercolor, face paint, gouache paint, um, markers, color pencils, crayons, 
oil pastels, tie-dye, all the things that you need for art, I have it. Journaling stickers, journaling paper, journaling notebook, all of that. I collect them. I don't use them. I collect it. <laughs> I don't know. If you had a warning label, what would yours say? <laughs> um, caution, hot. <laughs> so actually, I have a bad temper. I'm hot-headed. Um, and it's just because sometimes when you already ask somebody to do it once and they waited for you to ask it again, it just gets to me. How many pairs of shoes do you own? Oh, this one is actually very interesting. I actually don't know. So let's find out how many shoes do I own. Okay, I'm here in my shoe cabinet. So the first three here, the, there are four, <laughs> you can't see them. Okay, so one, two, three. The first three, um, we don't need to pay attention to those because those are used for storage like Bailey's, um, Bailey's toys, Bailey's things. I don't even want to open it because it's so messy. So these one, two, three, four, five, six, these are mine. Here I have my sneakers, autumn boots, <laughs> some sneakers as well, winter shoes, gym shoes, and some things that I use for the gym as well. This one is also mine. Here we have some heels and things that I use to go to the park. Uh, more, <laughs> more shoes, uh, ex gym shoes, winter or oh, autumn boots. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah. Oh, this one. This ones are. These ones are actually mine. These are made for the winter when it gets really cold, just for the house. These are some of the slippers that I keep for guests. Oh yeah, we also have here. So, um, running shoes. Slippers, another running pair of running shoes, and some some Crocs for going out. Oh, there's a. <laughs> okay, I need to fix this. Ah, I don't want to fix it. Okay. Also, these slippers. So yeah, these are all mine. Yeah. Actually, not that much. <laughs> I bought some of those shoes way, way, way back in the past. Like I think it was the first year that I came here in China and. I didn't have a lot of stuff, so, so I really needed to buy some stuff. <laughs> okay, next, yellow. Okay, what would you sing at karaoke night? My go-to song is Because of You by Kelly Clarkson. Because of you, I never stray too far from the sidewalk. <laughs> My go-to Chinese song is... Um, I It goes something like this. Like, uh, biggest fear. I'm actually a very brave girl. <laughs> yeah, I don't fear a lot of things. Maybe like like for example, if I die alone, yes, of course I don't. I'm not afraid of that. Um, it's very sad if I die alone and nobody comes to my funeral, right? It's really sad, but it's not like I'm afraid of that. Like, green. Worst gift you ever received? Maybe Bailey. Bailey was actually a gift from my boyfriend. So Bailey, Bailey is the worst gift ever. Cause she's so, she's just so, come on, come on. She's so, so, see? <laughs> She's so angry. She's so she's so sweet. She's so angry. She's like the love of my life. So she is like the best. She is the worst and the best gift ever. So actually my boyfriend gave me Bailey because we wanted to take our relationship to the next levels. I'm still so young to get married and we don't really want to get married right now. So we just thought of like why not just get a dog? kind of like the same responsibility of having a child. What would you rather do? Wash dishes, clean bathroom, laundry, or vacuum the house? Everything. I love cleaning actually, especially after I bought the vacuum and mop kind of thing. So I, it's been very easy to clean for me, like vacuuming and mopping the floor. I can do it like all at one time. Next. Are you a clean or messy person? If you watch the, the, my <laughs> vlog, my birthday giveaway vlog, yes, I am a very messy person. But when I realize that I'm very, very messy, I try to clean up after myself immediately. 
because it gets to me. Like I, do, I can't really do anything if I feel things are quite messy. Phone app do you use the most? Yeah, TikTok, Chinese TikTok, Douyin, uh, because I learn Chinese there and I watch a lot of dramas there as well. Notion, I, I love Notion. If you watch my other video, I love Notion as well. It organizes my life. It is like my journaling. It's like a notebook, but app version. <laughs> that, I don't know how to explain. I love Notion. Tubebuddy is an app that I use to monitor my YouTube channel. It helps me understand the analytics and metrics of how to grow my channel, what to change in order to boost the views and the subscriber counts and all those things. I love TubeBuddy because every time I hit a milestone, let's say um, 10,000 views on my channel, they give me this kind of um, email or this badges that I find it really cute and it's really motivating to receive those kind of letters. Like Another thing that I like about TubeBuddy is the suggestion tags that I give every time I uploaded a new video. Like Let's say I upload this video and I I titled it um, 28 things about me so it, it will automatically suggest tags that I can use so that people would come to my videos more. Yeah, I like true buddy. That. Yay! Yay! So that is it. Thank you so much for watching things about me. Okay, I hope that you've gotten to know me better and hope that you're into this kind of content where I just vlog about myself, um, vlog about the things that I do here at home. But of course, I still do travel vlogs, lifestyle vlogs, and other kind of vlogs here in my channel. So if you're into that content, consider subscribing, liking this video, and sharing this to your friends if you're into that. Okay, bye-bye.